How to tell if a bank is safe? Last week, a client asked me if his bank is still safe. How to tell if a bank is safe is a very frequent question. How do I know if my bank is still safe for my money? What tells me a tier one capital ratio and the Texas ratio? After this video, you will know the most important criteria to tell if a bank is safe and where to find other ratios and key figures to tell if a bank is safe. Watch out! Parking your money with the wrong bank in the wrong jurisdiction is a fatal mistake and can cost you a fortune. Stay tuned! Hello, I'm Enzo Caputo in partnership with Ducascopi TV. I am the international private banking lawyer, the owner of the boutique law firm Caputo and Partners and the founder of SwissBankingLawyers.com, the place where successful international business people find tips and solutions to better protect their assets and pay less tax. There are many important decisions we have to make in life. We have to decide where to work, who to marry, how much money to spend, how to protect our assets and where to set up our bank accounts. Before choosing an offshore jurisdiction and a bank, please watch this video until the end. Parking your assets in the wrong place can end in a financial disaster. One of the most important asset protection strategies is to take a substantial part of the money out of the influence of the authorities at home, out of the influence of the place of residence. I made a video on the most secure countries for private banking and asset protection. It's a video with the most important banking jurisdiction and with the most important financial centers. 30% of all non-resident bank accounts in the world are managed in Switzerland. There is no doubt Switzerland is the most reliable and best jurisdiction for private banking and asset protection. If you will open your account with a bank in the European Union, since 2017 your account will be subject to bail-in legislation. In case of a financial crisis, the government can take your money and give you shares of the undercapitalized bank. The same information of client money into shares of the weak bank happens in Cyprus a few years ago. Check my articles about bail-in legislation on my website. If you open an account with the Swiss bank, your assets are located in a very safe and reliable jurisdiction. The best banks for my clients are not the biggest and not the smallest banks. How to tell if a bank is safe? I introduce my clients to Swiss banks who are not the exposed to derivatives trading, not exposed to risky investment banking activities and not exposed to risky lending activities. If you want to measure the risks connected to risky lending activities, you can measure the exposure with the taxes ratio. Anyway, all the Swiss banks I introduce my clients have a tier one capital ratio of at least 20% or even more. Unfortunately, I can't mention the names of the banks. Swiss banks don't like to be mentioned. They are very sensitive. I'm happy to disclose the names of the best banks to you in a face-to-face -face meeting in my office. We will find the best bank for your specific situation. The right choice will be tailor-made to your needs and expectations. Swiss banks like to work with people they trust. Therefore, I will introduce you personally to the Swiss bank and help you negotiate all in fees. Never accept the standard terms and conditions. We know the industry standards. We know what is a fair pricing. Based on my introduction, I can guarantee you that you will save 20 or even 30% banking fees for sure. In order to guarantee a well-diversified portfolio mitigating the risk of investments, your minimum balance should be 500,000 Swiss francs. With a lower amount, you cannot diversify your investments as it should be. In order to avoid conflict of interest situation with the bank, I will introduce you to an independent and best-in-class asset manager having a package deal in place with the Swiss bank. The package deal is crucial for obtaining attractive banking fees. As the safety of a bank may change, I supervise the banks of my clients every quarter on a regular basis. My clients will receive an email every three months with a reporting of the safety of the bank. It's an ongoing process. 
check my private banking directory on my website with the most important key figures of 115 private banks in Switzerland. The choice of the right bank is an important decision because the average duration of a Swiss bank account is 17 years. I never lost a client. They all enjoy peace of mind because they know exactly that there is no better asset protection than Swiss banks located in a safe jurisdiction like Switzerland. They all enjoy the well-developed banking system and efficiency of multilingual staff. Insider information just like this cannot be found in universities, in libraries and not in the internet. If you like information just like this, make sure to not miss the future videos with me as your Swiss banking lawyer Enzo Caputo in partnership with Ducascopi TV. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel by clicking the subscribe button now and ring the bell. Be rich and stay rich. Have a wonderful day.